the area's most watched news station. In a few minutes, thank you. More homeowners than ever before seeking the sun as a solution to the energy crisis. As CBS 12's Stephanie Gailhart tells us, the solar energy business has nearly tripled in the last year. Well, you wouldn't know it from looking at this home, but this home has gone green. And these days, more and more homeowners are doing just that. They're installing solar water heaters in an effort to bring down their utility bills. Well, the panel sitting up on the roof, the sun's beaming down on it all day, heating up the water in there. So this little solar electric tank takes the water from those panels on the roof and puts them down into your storage tank. Solar Development Incorporated recently installed this new solar hot water heater in Arnold Rothstein's North Palm Beach home. Like most these days, the senior citizen is fed up with high energy costs. Not only a financially good thing to do, it's a very green good thing to do. An electric water heater is the biggest energy user of all appliances in a home. His switch to solar now saves him about $50 a month. $50 is very nice to have. This home is one of about 200,000 homes in the country right now that are using some type of solar technology. With our energy problems, Solar Development Incorporated insists solar power just makes sense. A solar water heater can cost anywhere from three to six thousand dollars. The savings can be up to a thousand dollars a year. With the new federal tax credits that are available, the new Florida solar rebates, you've got these systems are going to pay for themselves in two to four years. Then you've got 20 years of free energy. Installing a solar water heater is a fairly easy project. It can be up and running in about a day and a half. On Singer Island, Stephanie Galehard, CBS.